Hello, 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 hello. How are you guys doing? Thank you guys so much for joining Tierra Soro. I appreciate you guys clicking onto my video. This video will be for all my beautiful and my handsome Scorpios out there. How y'all doing? How y'all doing? Keep in mind that this is a general reading, so it's not going to resonate with everyone. So please take the parts that does and what doesn't leave it all out. Also, this could be the past, the present, or in the future. And to be aware of any scammers in the comment section pretending to be me. Okay, Scorpio. We got a lot to cover on this table, baby. I mean, a lot of information here, okay? Um, Lord have mercy. So, the truth is be about to be exposed about some dark energy, okay? So, you guys are going to be figuring out where the dark energy is coming from, okay? Who was sending these evil spirits, negative spirits, evil eyes towards you, okay? It's about to be exposed within this next week for some of y'all. This dark energy is about to be exposed. Who was sending this to you or what have you? Um, let me go down the list, boo boo, of what came out. So we got here secret admirer. So there is someone here that is definitely watching you here, Scorpio. Um, or you could be this uh person that's watching. You know how Scorpio's got the little my mask of Scorpio's being, you know what I'm saying, watching and watching. But anyway, um, there is a secret admirer that is watching you. Some of you, it's like this person could definitely be fine as hell, or this is you, Scorpio. Some this secret admirer is fine is a motherfucker. Okay, is what they saying. Now some of y'all, this person is a silent storm, though. Don't get this confused because I'm definitely getting that this person's coming out as a little bit shy. Okay, but they do have a another side to them, if you know what I'm saying. For some of y'all, you could be messaging this person right now. Okay, um, I don't know. You could know this person that says I start over. I don't know. You could be starting over with this individual or this person wants to start over with you. Silent storm. Ooh, yeah, this person got a lot, you know what I'm saying, a little, a little ways about them, I'm going to say. Okay, but we also have here, as much as this person is watching you, there's someone else watching you that's attached to this masculine energy. It says she knows about you. So, whoever this masculine is, they could have been at one point in time a playboy or a playgirl. For some of y'all, the person that's watching, them, uh, watching you could be a baby mama that knows about you. It says baby mama here. So, if your person got a baby mama or what have you, they are definitely watching you. Um... Okay, it's what I'm getting. This whoever this masculine energy is, they they think they like your um your breast, boo boo. They like the shape of your breast, the size of your breast, everything about your breast, the every older everything about your boo. They like that, okay? It's this is what I'm getting. Whoever this person is, it says um I'm making a U-turn. So I don't know, maybe you and this person is starting over or something of that nature, okay? But just know this baby mama, I don't know if they're going to be a problem or what, but they are popping up and this person does know about you. It's not, I'm not saying that they're attacking you. Maybe they are. Maybe this dark energy is coming from this person as well. But I'm not getting just this person, okay? Somebody's mad about the fact, this is why you and not me. I guess somebody's feeling like they're mad because somebody chose you and not them or something of that nature. So that could be a reason why they're watching you. Spirit is telling you to not feel sorry for someone in particular. Okay, this could be a friend of yours. It says, I'm not your friend. So there's somebody here that's, that, that is not your friend. Somebody's facing some type of karma. Spirit is telling you, don't feel sorry for this individual. If you see them going through something, don't feel sorry for them, okay? Then we got here, 222. Two, two. So some of you, you, you know, know that you are on the right path. You are in alignment. You are going down the right path. Don't worry, okay? But the truth is going to be exposed because your ancestors are on somebody as hard as back. Okay, they're on them hard. Whoever this warlock is, okay, this masculine energy, this could be an ex, this could be anybody, okay? But they're coming up as a warlock. They could have a fade a dress or a ponytail, okay? That's what I'm getting, all right? So whoever these people that was sending you some type of dark energy, this person was even throwing some type of dark magic or I'm getting like some graveyard dirt for some of y'all as well. Whoever this person is, this person is... Now feel some type of way because they know that you have went through some type of awakening and they know that you know what they have been doing behind your back, okay? Or some of y'all, your abilities are about to be heightened within this next week and your enemies are going to be exposed to you through downloads or just word of mouth or just their actions by something something that they might do, okay, within this next week here. So some of y'all keep a lookout, peep these, these people and their attentions at this time, okay? That's what I'm getting because it's a lot of energies that's going to be coming at you during this next week, okay? Now, we have here the best I ever had. Somebody feels like you are the best they ever had. Somebody could be a smoker here is what I'm getting. We got here tan and short. So some of you could be tan. You got the tan or beige color tone skin, a complexion. 
And it's like we got here a jealous man. There's somebody here that's jealous of you. This is a masculine energy, but just know that you are protected with 444 here. And with 000, there's a new beginning that's coming towards you. You're getting a refresh is what I'm getting. We also have here making noises when we make love. Can't help it. So whoever you're dealing with or you're having sex with or whatever like that, this person definitely feels like you got that bomb bomb. Okay, that's what we have here. The best I ever had. Because somebody, this masculine energy that you could be dating or dealing with or whatever, they feel like you got that bomb bomb. Okay, like you got you the best they ever had, the best they ever had. Okay, so that's why they, you know, so some men, when they are intimate with a woman, when they make a love to their woman or whatever like that, it's like they try to mask, you know, say how they, you know, what they say and they speak. Maybe they may speak dirty or whatever like that. Others might, you know, so, but as far as like making, you know, person like, I ain't gonna say it, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Like, moaning. Okay, some men trying to mask their moaning, but this man is like, they can't help it. It's like, it's just coming out because that thing is just so good. Okay, this is what I'm getting. That thing, it just overtakes everything. The feelings, the, the voice, you know what I'm saying? The throat shocker, everything. Okay. okay. Yeah, because somebody here woke, somebody dealing with a woke person. This could be you, Scorpio, or whoever, vice versa. Okay, confirmation. So, Somebody feel like you got that thing, okay? It says, look at me. Somebody wants you to look at them. I don't know if you're noticing them or not, or or there's somebody else that wants you to look at them. But whoever this person is, you got them blushing, boo. You got them blushing. They just, they just find themselves blushing. You know what I'm saying? Okay, but it says she woke. Yeah, somebody know you woke, baby. They know you woke out here in these streets here, Scorpio. And it says six months. I don't know what this is, six months to a year. What is this spirit? Let me see. Oh, let's see. Maybe you've been dealing with this person for six months to a year. Because it says, can you cook for me? Let's let's run away together. Big boss. Okay, foreplay. Mm, somebody freaky. All right, then we have here, I will never find another. Okay, people hate to, how we shine together. So people hate to see y'all be together. For some of y'all, I don't know if y'all with this person or not. Who the word fits? I'm getting so many, um, so much information. Somebody could also have the initial P, as in Paul. Yeah, empathic. Somebody knows that you have empathic. Like you're very empathic here. You have an empathic soul. It says, I'm afraid of this connection. This person also is afraid of this connection because they feel like you are just so healing to them, okay? They love the way you walk away from them. Then we got rich man. So somebody here got a, a couple of coins, uh -huh. okay, in the account, all right? But this person loves the way that you walk. They love that shot shade, that little sassy walk that you may have. That's for some of y'all, okay? Um, I'm, I'm keep getting drawn to fade, dreads, and ponytail. For some of y'all, whoever this person is, to have a fade or a dread or a ponytail. Or this could be the person that's trying to send you some type of dark energy. Put it where it fits. Yeah, temperance at the bottom of the deck here. Mm. That is serious energy. Yeah, somebody regret having other options or something of that nature. Whoever this person is, they regret flirting with people or, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Somebody could have also been, like, addicted to material things, okay? Like, access, cars, clothes, the way they looked or, how, you know, saying to other people out here in the world. But, yeah, this coming to an end here. Somebody's breaking a cycle, okay? Because they feel like, ooh, I'm telling you, with the hair fight energy, somebody feel like you are healing to them they want to settle down they want to be with you so you could be seeing a lot of fives five 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 oh yeah somebody is definitely um manifesting you at this time or you both could be manifesting each other or somebody just feel like oh my god like you are a magician you are a magician okay so somebody here they need you in a corner you're very loyal you're, okay you could be doing with a source capricorn energy um oh king of cups okay King of Cups, Wheel of Fortune. Wow. That's you, Scorpio. Okay. And the Chariot card, Cancer Energy. Somebody here definitely um, is about to, like, go forward here with something. Um, so, I don't know. Maybe they want to work with somebody here. Okay. Oh, yeah. Somebody's really too. This is the Secret Admirer. The person is watching the Page of Swords. Ooh. Somebody want to offer you something, boo. Okay. They want to work with you. They could be talking to other people about this. All right. Oh, but they feel like, yeah, let's see. What is this? Oh, I, I knew it. I'm telling y'all, there's a baby mama. She does wants to block this out. She There's a there's a mother figure here that wants to block the situation out between 
uh, this person, Scorpio. Here you go with the death card. Yep, somebody wants to block something else. Just know that. Okay, but nobody can block what's meant to be with the temperance energy. Okay, there is there is some um, spirit guys or um, angels here that are working behind the scenes to bring you guys together. Okay, or just working on you guys' behalf. Yeah, there's some sneaky behavior. In the background, somebody wants to skip a situation stuck, okay? Somebody wants somebody being, to stay in this player energy, this playboy, playgirl energy. Yeah. Yeah, somebody wants this to be a burden and not a success here is what I'm getting. Mm. Somebody's overburdened by somebody's success or some or attention or something. But something's about to balance out, okay? With justice being here, somebody's forced to move away from this situation, okay? Whoever this person is sending bad energy. Yeah, Empress Taurus and Empress Taurus and Earth Angel. Yeah, hell yeah. Okay, Libra energy. This mother figure. Yeah. Yeah, because this King of Pentacles is single. They're single. Okay, and they're really to mingle. This could be that rich man that's trying to come out. They're single that wants to date this independent woman. That could be one they want to date you here. Scorpio. Okay, ooh, that's the truth. Ooh, Ace of Cups. Yes. Sun car, Leo energy. Okay. Virgo energy as well. Somebody here definitely uh, sees the truth. And they're in love. And they're in love. I'm telling you, you got somebody blushing. They're like, man, not only is that thing a waterfall, okay? But, man, is their energy on 10. Like, she's everything. Yeah, somebody, somebody's going to reconcile or rebuild something with you, boo, period. Okay? Yeah, they're tired of feeling left out in the cold. This lover here. Yeah, they want this 10 of cups energy with you. And also, yeah, this uh, 7 of wands. They want to come in and protect this. Okay, but I see that this is protected. Some of you might have your guard up. That's not for everybody. But somebody else, somebody wouldn't give to you, baby. With the six of pentacles. Ooh, okay. The king of wands. The four of wands. And the three of wands. Okay, and the high priestess. So your intuition is telling you also about a king of wands. An Aries deal Sagittarius that wants to give to you. Okay. That's at a distance. All right. Yeah, the one, this person wants a relationship with you as well. So, ooh, Lord. Okay, Scorpio, what's going on, boo boo? Mm -hmm. You got somebody blushing. All right, but the truth is also about to be exposed about these people that was sending you some type of uh, negative energy, dark energy. Okay, but uh, yeah, so we're gonna see. We're gonna see on Wednesday, y'all. All right, Scorpios, I love you guys so freaking much. I need anything else from me? Look in the description box below. See you next time. Bye.